Hello YouTube, in this video I am going to review the Android 6.0 Marshmallow based Omni ROM for the OnePlus One. If you go to settings menu, about phone, you can find out I am running Android 6.0 and as well as the Omni build. And this is a OTA update, uh, you can check for the updates here. And then install it from there. So let's uh, go and check out the features in this room first of all figure the dialer app which is just regular dialer app and then messaging application web publication then if you talk about the camera camera is different because this is a camera ported from the oppo so it have it is having extra features like if you can go to the settings menu you can find all these settings scene mode true location this is like a lot of features included in this camera application and if you go to the video mode you can get this application as well and there is panorama feature so here in the camera application here is the SCE from there we can change the mode of shooting and then here is the extra effects front facing camera flashlight and then HDR turn on or turn off so that's all the features about the camera application so this camera is a very good build and uh, it is very stable so I highly recommend this camera application besides that we have all these application uh, like email is there gallery is there and Apollo it comes with as the default music player Apollo is a really good player and then calculator, calendar, clock, contacts, documents, downloads, um, Google is there, Google on tap, you need, if you want to turn on the Google app on tap, you can do it from here, you have to go to settings menu, Google on tap is here, so you need to turn on that feature. And then double tapping here it will open the uh, on tap I hope you already know about the on tap application on tap uh, feature I'll show you a sample here for example I'm tapping a first here then this page came then if I'm tapping and holding here for the Google on tap it will search for the screen and then give all the relevant information like about first film details are here and then other details the actor list you can simply go there and then do a individual searches which is pretty good and it should work on this music app also this should work so here you can see it's automatically find out the track name and the artist don't get me wrong I'm not a Justin Bieber fan it's a game a lot as well so besides that here is the Omni switch it's like the so if you are turning on the Omni switch feature you will get this small task manager replacement application here is a pretty neat and cool feature which comes with all the Omni build. So uh, you can switch between last application, kill the other apps, and then kill all apps. Because you can also go to settings menu, and then you can see all the application here. You can also pin. So this is like uh, an extra addition for the ROM. So is that all the, okay. here's the Snapdragon camera, so I forgot to mention this is a Snapdragon camera, not Oppo camera, so it's a highly recommended camera application and uh, if you go to settings menu, obviously is that if you tap on battery you can find out uh, battery saver and battery optimization, battery saver is uh, turn on the battery when the battery percentage is slow 
and the battery optimization is the DOS feature which comes with the Android Marshmallow so you can uh, particularly optimize some application for the ba better battery backup other than that if you get your the kitchen area and toggles here you go to settings menu you can find all the reverse settings and here is the bar Bars means nothing but uh, the status bar customization options you can see. So you can show the status bar, traffic monitor, disable it, things like that. Nothing much. Now on display features are here, and then you can customize the button from here. Other options are this is the memory application, memory setting, and from here you can see all memory usages. And here is the advanced. It means the double tap to make is there, camera touch is there, like off screen gestures. Basically, is that nothing worth mentioning? Everything is regular ROM supported. Then, in performance, you can play with the CPU counters for tweaking further. And then, the system UI tuner as well. So you can customize all these status bar. If you want to see the battery percentage there, you can see something like that. Overall, it's a like um, a little packed Android uh, Marshmallow ROM, so you can try it. And I'm, I'm happy with this ROM. It, it is actually more like a stock ROM only, but with some cool features, you can check out. And if you don't know how to install this song, there's a link in the description to show you that. Just go and check it out. That's it, guys. That's what you Please subscribe for more.